welcome to a day in our life so we already started our day well we just now started our day baby girl has a doctor's appointment her second doctor's appointment um so we're gonna go in a couple minutes that she have to actually put her in the car seat um but it has been literally so long since i've done like a vlog and i miss vlogging i love vlogging and yeah the last time that i did post a video it was my our baby shower and today we have baby girl here she was born on february 2nd at 10 47 p.m and she weighed seven pounds and four ounces and now she's here and she's literally the cutest little munchkin <laughs> This, the oh. smile is. She, she, she ready for the camera. She's cameras, ready. Look. look at her. <laughs> <laughs> Melody Salah Graham. Look! Oh my God. You know your name, mamas. Oh my God. Yeah, we I talking cannot. about you. She's so sweet. Oh, wow! That was so precious. She about to wake up and. <laughs> She's like, tight. I'm hungry again, even though I just fed her. You hungry, mamas? So, we gotta catch up, y'all. Like, we have to catch up. Like, the girl is here. The baby is here. It's so insane. Oh, my God. Like, this time last year, life was completely different. Uh oh. Uh, love that little girl we gotta go in but we are gonna catch up like don't let me forget we have so much to catch up on i'm so excited so my daughter is literally like we got into the office and i was like behind them like i had to look for the keys or whatever and she i walk in and she is screaming her head off and i literally fed her already but she's still hungry so we're gonna feed her again <laughs> But, um, yeah, this girl's gonna be a singer because she has literally the loudest cry. And, like, she screams at the top of her lungs from getting her diaper changed. <laughs> um, she's gonna be a singer. But right now, we're just waiting for the doctor to come. And then we'll see what they're talking about. Dang, I gotta remember when I go to Starbucks to ask for light ice because um, I feel like I just took two sips and it's already done. But I be getting the, nah, I don't remember it, that oatmeal, iced oatmeal, brown sugar, shaken espresso thing with uh, two pumps of white mocha and a vanilla cold foam on top excellent so bad. Uh, okay so let me catch you guys up so right we just went to the doctor's office um so basically we went yesterday her first visit or whatever and that went pretty well kind of um yesterday her weight dropped um from below so like when she was born she was seven pounds and four ounces or whatever um and then yesterday was like six pounds and something or whatever it just dropped so the doctor the pediatrician wanted to see her yesterday but i didn't really like the pediatrician yesterday because right now i'm breastfeeding and i was like obviously in the beginning having trouble because you know your milk doesn't come in right away so it's just like the cholesterol so like in when she was first born they were like her stomach is like super small so like you know she's not gonna eat a lot um but like when i tell you literally from the moment she was born like they gave her to me and then she went with her dad and then when she came back to me she was she latched perfectly like from the first latch perfect the sucking like perfect right that was never an issue for me um or for her for us so basically because of the, the the drop in her weight or whatever i'm obviously nervous about that so the doctor the pediatrician she was like recommending that i give my kid formula because if i'm ever tired then my husband can do it and it's like that's not my concern 
and even in the hospital like some of the nurses would be like oh like she's not latching good no she's sleeping which is why she's not latching like can you help me some of the nurses and doctors that i've seen it's like they're pushing the whole formula thing and it's like my kid latches my kid pulls everything like can you just help me learn how to do it the lactation person at the hospital this lady literally like helped me my cousin one of my cousins like helped me so much um and now my baby is above her birth weight just a little bit and i'm like oh my god that changed in just a day in a night so i was super happy about that um but yeah so the doctor i don't know she seemed like she was like in better spirits today um we have to go back in two weeks but i don't know i'm just gonna see how i feel like today i felt a little bit better because i don't know but it's also weird because i'm like if something god forbid goes wrong like are you just gonna be like like are you gonna just be you know like not making me feel good if that's the case i don't want you as my doctor because i'm a new mom like i want to feel like oh it's okay like we're gonna figure this out or whatever not you know like she was just like not a people person i guess um but today everything was fine so she was like more happy and jolly so it's like miss ma'am no i need you to keep the same energy <laughs> but you know these people are people as well but i'm sorry like this is my kid's health like i need you to make me feel more comfortable so we <clears throat> we went to starbucks we Girl, there's so much we got a new car literally yesterday um we've been y'all yeah, we've been having so much car trouble for months now and um once we bought the house we were like we that we would buy a car right away but everybody's like don't do it that is like the number one way that americans go into debt like crazy um we just really wanted something reliable but we had to kind of like take a sacrifice and just get like a used car so finally yesterday we did that and today we're going to get it registered and insured and everything there's just a lot going on but i'm enjoying every single day with my little munchkin she's literally the sweetest little thing she's the cutest little thing and i just love her we love her so much yeah so we're at the bank now because Vaughn forgot our cards at home, our cards at home. So he's about to get a new one so that we can get this car registered and everything. So yeah, that's where we're at right now. I will update you guys soon when we do the next thing. Ooh, girl. So we stopped at my mom's house because we had been in the car for a little while. So I wanted to like I wanted to change her and um and let her stretch because she was in the car seat for a little while. And she had her first massive like blowout. And that just goes to show like we be I was freaking worried. I'm like, she hasn't pooped, like, you know? And I have been praying, like, God, please align her whole insides, let her um let her weight be okay, let her poop, like you know just align everything with you god and i was like really worried about that i was on tiktok watching all these videos and today we had a massive blowout so it's like god cares about every freaking thing so wonderful i know god is like always going to protect us but i gotta invest in a um gun safe because uh this right here this right here. That's precious right there. Mm -hmm. Precious goods. That need. Oh, look, she's smiling. Look, she know. She already signed the contract. She's giving y'all all the smiles. She already signed the contract. Mm -hmm. No boyfriends till 2058. Mm. Whenever that is. She's like, what? <laughs> <laughs> right? Hey, mama girl. She said, anyway, so. Yo, I'm telling you, she's going to be a singer. There is no way she screams like that. Like, it's like a high-pitched scream, right? Right? Hello? 
Hmm? It's like a high pitch. Oh, hi, Mamas. She has like a high pitch scream. Hello. Mm -hmm. Okay, forget it. She has a high pitch scream. Like it's like, like really loud. <laughs> so she's gonna be a singer. She's gonna sing. She's gonna sing worship. She's gonna worship the Lord. Yes, you are, Mama. Mm -hmm. I just love her. Alright, so we are about to leave here. I'm gonna just get her dressed and then we're gonna head out and go home. I needed to get her comfy. I needed to change her diaper. I needed to feed her. But yes, like God really cares. Like I was worried about my milk supply. I was worried about all those things. Even like I was having some type of I don't know if it was pink eye. Like I don't know what the heck happened, but like uh, yesterday I woke up with like gunky eyes and stuff and I was literally praying like God Please take this away. Like I just want to be healthy for my daughter. Like don't like uh, help us all <laughs> to just be Healthy and you know all the things and he is just a provider and we don't even be deserving none of it uh, She's feeding right now. I don't know if I just said that but we're gonna go stay at my mom's house today for no reason, really. We, um, we were just on the phone with her. And she's actually taking off, like, two weeks of work so she can, like, come with, come, like, be here with me when I'm working. Or when Vaughn's working. Because he goes back to work tomorrow. So, I feel like everything was just all over the place just now. But, yeah, anyway, we're going to go... I'm gonna get all of our stuff together, um, and then we're go and Melody needs a bath today, so we're gonna do all that. And my mom's house. My mom could give her. Obviously, we gave her a good bath the other day, but like, I feel like the grandma's. My mom's a young grandma. <laughs> I feel like she's just gonna do it better, so. We're gonna do that. I gotta get all my stuff together. I think today I'm gonna end this vlog. I don't know what this vlog was supposed to be. I think I was gonna, it was supposed to be just like a, um, like day in my life with a newborn, but it ended up being all this. Yesterday, after we got home, I was just all over the place, girl. But I'm so tired. So, yeah. Basically, to sum it all up, <laughs> I'm gonna, after she's done feeding, I'm gonna, um, shower because i'm sure she's gonna go right back to sleep i'm gonna shower and then i'm gonna get all of our things together and then that's that y'all look at my child yo literally every time i pull out the camera she starts smiling She's just so precious. Oh, Melody, you are so sweet. Look at her. Oh, my mamas. Oh, you're such a sweet girl. Oh, my God. She literally... Can you... Like, I literally had her, like, up here, and she was not digging it. So, she's, lately, she's been putting herself in, like, these weird positions. Mm, so beautiful. Mm. I love you so much. Getting your stretchies, because we had you, we had you all wrapped up. Oh, this is like the best. How am I supposed to go back to work? I don't even want to think about work right now. Like, I just want to stay with you forever. Oh, you're so beautiful. 
I love you so much. I love you so much with your little double chin. She's not though. Mm. I love you. I love you. I love the mamas. You're so beautiful. You're the most prettiest girl in the world. You're the most prettiest girl in the world. Mm. Oh, sweet girl. Sweetness, sweetness. Oh, I love her. I'd be like, oh my god, in my mind, I'd be like, I just want to take her with me. And it's like, she's with me like she's mine. You're mine. And like, I'm just so grateful that God literally... You okay, Buki? That God literally trusted me with this beautiful thing. This beautiful little girl. Yeah. Oh, this is like the best. Okay. Oh, I just adore her. Okay, so I'm going to get ready now. <laughs> I'm going to put her down. I feel like she's going to want it. Well, I definitely have to feed her before we leave home because I can't have my bookie crying in the car. I can't have my, my girl hungry. So I'm going to... um. She likes vlogging. <laughs> She likes the vlogs. But yeah, I'm going to put her down. I'm going to get ready. And then we'll chat in a few. Oh, my God. I'm the only one. So my mom just made a Sunday dinner. Uh, what's today? On a Wednesday. Oh my God! Today's actually my due date. Oh yeah. Aww. I can't imagine if she. <gasps> oh my God. Wasn't here. Mm -hmm. <gasps> yeah. I'm giving like, birth today. Well, <laughs> yeah. Take a picture. I can't imagine Hi, that. Mamas. She's like, right at you. Like Hi. today being the day I gave birth. Like everything worked out so perfectly. I'm gonna show you what she made in just a second. Come here, you think you look cute? You are not to Yes. Yeah, so okay. Some yellow rice. What? White rice. <laughs> some steak, some corn, some mac and cheese. By the chef. Delicious. Daddy. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning, guys. At this point, this is a weekly vlog <laughs> because I'm doing anything. But um, so it's Thursday. Vaughn is back to work today, and I could literally cry. Like, bro, I was talking to him yesterday. Like, I'm literally gonna miss you so much. <laughs> this is a little sad, but um. I, the last couple of days, like, since we brought her home from the hospital, um, I feel like I low-key got, like, pink eye or something. But, like, it comes and it goes. But last night, it got, like, gunky, and it got really, really bad. So I was like, yeah, no, like, I need to go to the urgent care tomorrow. So my mom stayed with the baby, and I'm just like, I need my child. But I need to take care of me so that I can take care of her. Um, so I'm very good about like stuff like that about like noticing or just like pri not prioritizing but just like realizing that as a mom like I have to be in I need to be healthy you know what I mean or I need to like if I need a moment I need to take that moment oh my god this bus is literally about to flip over the curb <laughs> but um yeah so um and then like my throat is feeling a little weird like I've, I'm never sick all of a sudden I'm sick so I just want to go get checked out really quickly so that I can come back home to my baby and I can get um, 
and I can get stuff. And then I would have just taken like something regular from like CVS, but because I'm breastfeeding, I know I have to like be careful. So that's also why I'm going to urgent care because girl, I would have definitely been like, bring me the Mucinex, bring me the Visine or whatever, like, <laughs> but I can't. So here we go. I'm on my way there. Today is February 8th. I guess I'm giving myself a little like maternity leave from YouTube. Just, um, but I'm still obviously recording. So I'm gonna have like two vlogs for you guys. Either like the end of this month or by March. Um, and you guys will obviously that when the time comes. But I'm just, girl, I'm trying to be on my content creator wave. And like to be honest, like I'm just not ready to go to work. I go back in April, April 8th. But I'm not looking forward to it. Like, I'm just so un unwell about the thought of it. And I know so many other parents, like, I mean, majority of people go through this. And I'm just not ready. So, let's get these. <laughs> help me. Help me, y'all. <laughs> Boost my, subscribe, my subscriptions. But, yeah. Let me go get this done and then I'll chat with y'all in a little bit inside urgent care and i'm like uh, so freaking annoyed because i never get sick ever and my eye wants to be acting weird what nothing they tested they tested me for covid and i'm um, the flu um my eye my throat wants to start hurting i'm feeling a little stuffy all this stuff and then i have like some like thing happening right here i'm like bro what is this about? It's, it can be like because I'm not sleeping. I don't freaking know we're gonna sleep. But I, the day I gave birth, I was like, I was like 180 something. A girl was 159 right now. Like, I lost all my baby weight pretty much. Let me show y'all what I'm looking like. I think the doctors are gonna come in any second now, so let's see what they're saying. <sighs> Y'all, I am over here bawling my eyes out. I like I was listening to this um this Christian art I just found this Christian artist on um on TikTok actually and she has this song called Created for This. This is her, her name is Francesca, I guess. Oh my god, and this song, like, literally has me, I have a snot. <laughs> I'm my eyes out over here because, like, I was listening to it and I just feel like I was created to be this little girl's mom. <laughs> like, all those times, all those miscarriages. <laughs> And I'm just like looking at her. Sorry, I have boogers. <laughs> I'm just looking at her and I'm just like, I was literally created to be her mom. And like, she was created for us to be her parents, for me to be her mom. Like, like God chose me to be her mother. Oh, I'm sorry, Millie. God chose me to be her mom and she's just so precious and I just like literally pray that God just helps us to be literally the best parents that we can be and that he just like that he just protects her every day of her life like I'm just so grateful like every day like I look bruh I'm bleeding my nose ring stabbed to the inside of my nose so much <laughs> okay that was so dramatic <laughs> every day like i look at like her i'm like so i was looking at her ears and like her nose and i'm just like like god did that like in my body like he created every inch of her every single inch of her he did this and she's like mine, she's mine. And like, my mom has been 
so good to me so so good and the fact that like now like I get to be that for her like I have big shoes to fill so and I want to be as great as a mom as my mom was to me or is to me <sighs> if you know me you know I am always very emotional <laughs> but I think being postpartum has like increased it a lot <laughs> just so grateful so blessed so happy with my little pumpkin I love you so sweet so cute so yeah update on earlier Whew, that's a lot they tested me first trap covid flu i came back and i was negative place lower because i was so, so scared i have like this weird like i don't think you guys can see it let me see i don't know this weird like rash type thing um i don't know what it is so they prescribed me some type of like topical cream and then for my eyes because like for some reason i've been getting like almost like pink eye symptoms but it doesn't last all day it's just in the morning so they prescribed me something for this my throat still does feel feel a little bit weird but i'm just gonna drink tea nothing's wrong with me so whatever but and then we're gonna literally call it a night so i'm gonna talk to you guys tomorrow She said, mm. yo, I promise you guys. She's smiling. <laughs> <laughs> Always. She just really likes, well, I really like this. <laughs> we changed her clothes and things. <laughs> but if you guys see this in the video all the time, it's because we wash it and reuse, we wash it, and reuse it literally. <laughs> so look at my pink eye situation. I just don't even know. My mom's here. She made these bomb, like, it's never tasted this good. <laughs> Just for you. <laughs> these bomb behind sandwiches. Oh, hold on. And we're over here tearing them up. Y'all, this girl is literally sleeping a lot more now, and I just, like, I'm just so happy. I was fighting for my life, for real. <laughs> I was about to stop breastfeeding, but the cluster feeding in the beginning lasted a couple days, and that was really tough, but now that my milk is finally in, it's smoothed down. So thank you, Jesus, because that was a lot. Eat and go sleep. <laughs> yeah, finish pumping and I will go to sleep. Hey, sis. Oh, wait, I need to turn this off. Hold on. Because I have the camera on. Wait, let me just do this. I have the, the baby monitor on downstairs and it's echoing and things. But, um, yeah, girl, I'm over here. Baby girl is up. Y'all, my mom being here um, is literally such a blessing. So earlier, I, um, after I talked with you guys, um, I did not take a nap today. <laughs> but it's okay because I think baby girl will sleep throughout the night. I think I feel like she did a little bit of cluster feeding earlier, so hopefully she's all set for the night. I'm currently feeding her right now. Mm. Hold on, look at this adorable picture. She's so cute. <laughs> Anywho, um, y'all, I took a long shower. I washed my hair, deep conditioned my hair. I shaved. I feel so good. I was able to moisturize all the things and my baby girl you, you helped me do that because you weren't crying you weren't crying before <laughs> ouch so yeah so vaughn's off of work he's about to make some burgers so he just wants to stop stop and shop yeah he just wants to stop and shop so that he can get the stuff for burgers and then we're just gonna like literally chill for the rest of the night um I think tomorrow will be my last day vlogging. I li this li <laughs> I'm so weak because this was literally just supposed to be like a a day in the life, but it turned into like a weekly vlog. Which I'm cool with it if you're cool with it. I'm cool with it. Um, if not, girl, I don't know. I just be going. If not tomorrow, then definitely Sunday will be the last 
day of this vlog. I have two vlogs coming for you. I have my labor and delivery vlog and this one. So I need to like start editing so I can create storage. And girl, literally I have been editing on CapCut because I don't have a computer. Um, let's see, CapCut has been my editing software and it like works for now until we get our mini up if you know what i mean we're just trying to prioritize things and as much as i love creating content it is a priority to me but like i kind of have to sacrifice and use my phone which it's it's kind of a hassle but you gotta do what you gotta do sometimes you know what i mean <laughs> you took a burpees mommy you want to give me another burpee? <laughs> I love you, girl. All right, I think she's good. I need to actually pump. I'm going to do that now. All right, pump do you guys use? Because I've been using the Medela. And the only thing is I cannot stand like having to sit there and hold it for 15 minutes and then like the part one of the pieces it like if you don't hold it the right way it leaks milk and do you know that twice it leaked milk i was so freaking mad like pumping is really freaking hard work so for that to like not work or for the thing to to do that really stressed me out but i've been having really great pumping sessions this is like the second day that I pumped or third day I just have to be more consistent with doing it after each feeding because I do want to start creating well I've started creating a stash but I also want to start bottle feeding her just so that she's not so used to like the breast and so that her dad can also have time to like feed her because that's like one thing that I've been that we notice like immediately is that like when you breastfeed as amazing as it is like Hey, mommy, am I talking too much? <laughs> as amazing as breastfeeding is, like, it kind of, it's all on mom at that point. And I'm not complaining at all. I'm just saying, like, I want my husband to be able to feel as connected to our daughter as I do. And with breastfeeding, it's hard, especially especially when they start cluster feeding. It's like, mom, 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 right? And which is fine. Like, I'm your mother. I have what you need baby girl but I also want him to to have that like closeness with her not saying that he does it now but I just want him to be able to feel more connected to her and her more with him I don't know this is him all right for all y'all pumping I think she's good I'm gonna put her down and I'm gonna go pump turn around why you want the money or not? Like <laughs> yeah, that's cool, I guess. It's her first time drinking from a bottle. It's different for her. She's <laughs> she learning. <laughs> Should we finish this first? Yeah. It's coming out too fast, <laughs> moments. I gotta go. Would you lock up? Give her. Right, no, she's so These ones are pretty. It is Saturday morning. I am up. It's like, what time is it? It's 8 30, and I fed the baby. I pumped already because i'm trying to get on um, like the pumping wave just so i can have a stash and just so like that Vaughn, like i said yesterday Vaughn can start feeding her and stuff <clears throat> but right now i'm making some oatmeal <gasps> my god's gonna die some oatmeal with some chobani and some fruits um my camera's gonna die literally any second so i'll talk to you guys after i charge it if it dies while i'm still recording so brown sugar oatmeal with some vanilla Chobani yogurt with some apples and some chamomile, um, some chamomile tea and some honey. Girl, bomb.
giving snap back. Mm -hmm. Delicious. Delicious. <laughs> Whew. All right, so I'm about to take the baby up bath, a little sponge bath. Her umbilical cord hasn't fallen off yet, so we're stuck doing this until it does. Hi, Kate. I can't wait until it falls out because I just need to give my girl, like, yeah, and she's about to scream. She is not about to be happy. This is what I'm working with right now. I have on my like Freedom Mom boy shorts. So comfy. And then my pajamas that I've been wearing since last night. I need to take a shower myself. Let's see. Oh, this is cute, but it looks big. Zero to three months. What do we think? This looks super big. Let's see, what is this? Newborn. Oh yeah, baby. There we go, girl. And then, so she has this. And then we have a rag and a towel. I'm gonna put this blanket down. Bro, do you guys hear Luna? She is like so unhappy. Now I need to go fill this with some warm water ever since we got the baby home the dogs have been acting so weird and it's just a like big change for them they're so used to having like all of our attention that now it's like ma'am what's happening here so i have not given her a bath yet like my mom has and vaughn has and then like we did it at the hospital because i don't know if i told you guys already but you're not supposed to give newborns, like, or until their umbilical thingy comes off. Hold on, let me focus, because I will be the one to drop all this water. When, until the umbilical cord falls off, I'm not supposed to um, give her, like, bath baths. And they told me to do every other day. Okay. Sorry, y'all. I'm nervous. She's sleeping so peacefully. I'm going to wake her up. I'm sorry, mamas. I'm sorry, my stinky girls. I'm sorry, my stinky girl. Mommy's waking you up. Girl, looking back at this, I'm like, why would you wake a sleeping baby? You could tell I'm a new mom because why? Why would I ever do that? I'm going to give you a bath in the face first. Mama's bothering you. Sorry, boo -boos. Mama wants to give you a nice bath. Oh. Yes, you do, Mama. Let's get the soapies out. Mama wants baby to have a clean body. time is done she's currently eating when i tell you this girl be screaming her head off like she does not like to be bothered at all <laughs> like she's like please like you just woke me up out of my sleep but anytime like if we do something other than um than feeding her oh like leave me alone she hates her diaper being changed like everything but now we have a clean mama and a fed mama. I want to do tummy time with her, but I feel like that was that whole bath time experience was a lot. <laughs> so maybe that's a like later or tomorrow thing because she was not happy. What is this? A cucumber? No, cucumber? Uh -huh. A cucumber? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So I have my uncle here and he's over here. Cooking dinner for us or whatever. We got some. Wait. Some pasta. 
Oh wait, can I have one? Some salad. Oh. These are so delicious. Yeah. I think the last time we talked was after the baby shot, the after I gave her a bath. Bro, she cluster fed for like three hours. And that was a lot. Oh, go! One thing about me, as soon as my kid starts crying, I'm picking her up. You ready to eat more, Mama? What's wrong, boo boos? The food's about to be done. We're about to eat and watch some TV and chill. This looks delicious. I can't wait to eat. Good morning, family. So it is Sunday morning. Today's gonna be the last day of this vlog. It was never supposed to be a weekly vlog, but here we are. <laughs> so this morning, Vaughn woke up. Me and Melody slept in, and he made breakfast. He had some worship music going on. It was a whole vibe. <laughs> but now we're about to take the baby to the doctor because it's looking like her umbilical cord it looks like a little weird and we don't know like what it's supposed to look like it looks like it's literally about to fall off now but it looks really weird so we're just gonna take her to the doctor just to get checked just in case you know we have insurance for a reason so i'm very blessed that we're able to do that um is there anything you want to say to the vlogmas i'm tired <laughs> um yeah so we're gonna actually end this vlog right here. I'm hoping that I can have this vlog out by the end of February. Um, if not, you guys will see this eventually. We are in the newborn trenches. We're learning our baby and our baby's learning us. So this is a beautiful thing and I can't wait to bring you guys on the journey with us. So per usual, thanks for watching, thanks for supporting, and we love y'all. Bye.